Okay, so today, my friend the athlete has rendered the nurse or the new nurse cosmetic in 4K, so I thought I would show that off for you guys so you can see it all together, because I think not a lot of people will have it, or all of it apart from the weapon. So that's what it is right there. You'll see in game it has this like little black dust coming off with it, this little black animation, which is also really really cool part of the cosmetic which i think is really nice that they added but i wanted to show you it all together so you can you know look at it and see what you think of it but i think it is really really good i like how they kept the roses in to match the nurse's cosmetic and that she does have this like red hair off of the back of the face mask thing that she has on so i think overall it's a really really nice skin as well as the glove looks really nice in game and it's only like tier 15 or tier 20 to get the head and the body so you can pretty much start using it straight away without the weapon and then this is the weapon so we've got again the black like dust coming off of the weapon it looks kind of similar to some of the ones that you can get in the store but i like how it has the rose on it so it's similar to the rose blade in that way it's keeping it to the nurse's aesthetic as in we've got the rose and the red hair it's like it still based on her lore and exactly how they want it to look. It had, they haven't changed that much at all. But overall, it looks like a really nice cosmetic. I'm excited to use it. The game is an absolute, like the new game is such a good map for us. Like such, ooh, I love that. Look at the glove. Damn. I like this cosmetic already. This new game is incredibly bad for uh, M1 killers, because there's a lot of safe pallets, like that one right there. What can I hear them? I can hear them above me. There's a lot of safe pallets, but for the nurse, look at this top area. It's so open. All of this top area is incredibly open and just free range for the nurse to just go and be an absolute demon and down as many people as she wants. And they've given me my haunted. The last totem that's up is my devourer now. Because they cleansed my undying. And then they cleansed my haunted straight after. But I should be able to get three devour stacks. From this haunted if I play it right. Especially with the mega blink. There should be another survivor here actually. No way. I actually blinked on her back. That's fucking crazy. Okay. Hook up. Damn, even this in the bottom right, like constantly. Or the bottom left, actually, when you're blinking, you always have those black specks on your screen. I don't know if that's going to get annoying or if that's just going to be fine, but that's definitely interesting. We got the Steve right at the end of our Haunted Ground, so we do actually get three stacks of Devour now. You. They cleansed my Devour. I'm so sad. Literally everything, and they pop three totems at the start of the game. Damn, I wish I got survivors like this when I was running Haunted Retribution. They're cleansing everything early. What are you doing, Steve? What's the plan here? You're dumb tacking a nurse. I've got to assume that you have D-Strike, right? If you're doing stuff like that. No D-Strike either, Steve. What are you doing? guy's insane. Oh, that's why. This is a dead end. Okay, I never noticed that. But even if, as I'm carrying the body here, you see the blade, and then you can just see the black specks coming up the top of it. Aesthetically, I think it looks really nice, the animation. But I don't know if that's just gonna get annoying over time. We'll have to see. This poor Steve ran into me again. Just gonna put him on the floor for now. I don't really want to hook him this early and kill him this early. We'll let him play for a little bit longer. Oh, that's the Fang. And she is that hard. And I got swing cancelled. Nice, nice. If you can just chase on this top area with Nurse, it's so devastating. I don't know where she went. For some reason, I didn't see these scratch marks go this way at all. The good thing is, though, that's a breakable wall, so she's stuck here. Nice! Okay, let's hook that. And I only see one survivor over here. I think that's a Steve again. It's This game has just been me finding the Steve over and over and over again. There is somebody on that gen, I'm pretty sure. Let's get them off that. 
The survivor standing animation looks so weird. That's gotta be it that hard. I'm pretty sure I swung into her back there, but that's okay. Is that you, Cheryl? I can barely see anything in this room. Okay, that was dead hard. That's so weird then. Why did my first hit not connect? Interesting. Okay, well we got it with a nice flick there, so it's all's well that ends well. And there should be someone up here. Well, there is someone up here, because there's two lots of scratch marks and they popped the gem. Okay, this fang is a key I didn't even realize. We should probably kill her then. I don't really want them using a key. Wow! <laughs> the Steve had head on and the fang baited her out. Oh my. That's insane. Steve ran right past the Cheryl. What are they doing? It's like a sandbag, Tony. They're all sandbagging each other. Okay, that's not a room. I thought that might have been one of the corner rooms, but it wasn't. Okay, let's just hook the phone. Okay, Fang's dead. The Steve's death hook. I'm not sure about the other two. I think the Cheryl was only first. Okay, the Steve is up. I forget to look up there sometimes. Because it feels so unnatural to me, with the update only being out for a day. It feels so unnatural to look in the top left to see what the survivors are, or what state they're in. Okay, and now we got these two literally right next to each other. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk here, so that they won't react to me blinking. Okay, never mind, because they're going to react to that. What is that? Why can I blink into mid-air? That shouldn't be a thing. Oh, she was fully healed. Okay, she got her heal off. I should be able to one blink her anyway. Nice. And that is GG. I mean, I think we showed off the cosmetic reasonably well. I'm really like... This animation does look really nice. And I do really like the glove as well. I'm interested to see what it will look like when we have the full cosmetic. But I think they did a really good job with this cosmetic. It does look really, really nice. Definitely will be using it in the future. There you go. There's a little outward view of the cosmetic on the right there.